Hello and welcome to this quick video that I feel absolutely compelled to make after just seeing the misinformation being spread right now on the web about the reasons of this Bitcoin drop, which for me, that is kind of a real dangerous situation because people look towards these guys, they have influence and yeah, really, I suppose they, they think that they know what they're talking about, but simply put, they don't. <laughs> so I'm here to show you the truth, back it up with actual facts on the chart, I can back it up with statistical data and evidence really, the data in front of you I will share and show and just actually give you the real reasons for this Bitcoin drop from a trader's perspective of somebody that can trade, can understand this market and can absolutely generate profits from it. So with that said, I wanna show you here very quickly the reasons for this drop. And to do that, we're gonna be coming over here and looking at the absolute evidence in front of our eyes, okay? So the first thing that we're gonna to need to bring our attention to, I suppose, is actually the fact that we had, over the recent week, continuous higher lows being printed here on the chart. So higher low, higher low, higher low, higher low. What does this mean? People that are in longs over the past week are able to trail their stop losses up with the higher lows, right? So their stop losses are getting trailed upwards. So as price starts to edge down, naturally, these stop losses are gonna be triggered. What happens here is those stop losses can be triggered and also when many stop losses are triggered at the same time, it can cause slippage, okay? So reason number one of a few that we're gonna go over here is simply stop losses getting hit, a natural part of the trading game, stop losses. When we have to then factor in the liquidity right now and slippage, that's another factor. Okay, the biggest factor that we're gonna be approaching together here is the fact of the liquidation run. Really simply, what we have seen down here is the reason of this drop is a liquidation, you know, cascade, so to speak, okay? We can tell that by looking at the volume, the delta, the CVD, and the open interest. That together can provide us a very, very good factual insight into the market of real executed orders in front of our eyes. We can see the multi-million dollar selling imbalances in this candle. What does that show us when compared with the open interest and the delta for myself? This shows to me that it is simply over leveraged positions getting stopped out. When we add on the wrecked bubbles, we can also tell that this is liquidations. They are really simply over leveraged longs getting liquidated. Now, how do I pair this with the CVD to also give me even more data? Over recent days, after seeing this swing failure pattern, we'd obviously seen bearish divergences on the CVD. This shows us a lot of leveraged, okay, well, not necessarily leverage at this time, but a lot of aggressive longs coming into the market and the bigger player with the shorts holding price down. We had seen this appearing several times on the chart with those bearish CVD divergences. We ended up going sideways for a bit, and then we start to get this push to the downside, which is affected then by the stop losses, getting their stop losses hit. That turns into a bit of slippage. That turns into then the leverage longs, really simply getting liquidated. All of that paired together at the same time gave us a liquidation, high volume, high negative delta drop to the downside, okay, with simply put the open interest decreasing. That then shows to us and proves to us factually speaking that this reason to the downside was longs getting liquidated and longs getting stopped out. Pair that with a low liquidity environment, pair that with the slippage, that's the reason why we see a 5% move down very quickly indeed, okay? We're talking about in, in minutes. Quick move to the downside, longs getting liquidated. We can see all of that that we need to know in front of our eyes, in the chart, on the order flow. And of course, we did have a few levels, the daily, the NPOC, but even look at this on a one minute chart, you go straight through those levels, straight through the level, straight through the level. There is no reaction, there is no trade, thus there is no long setup to be had here locally, and we look for our next levels to the downside, right? No reaction off the daily, no reaction off the NPOC. Keep those shorts open at that time as you look down for lower, okay? There's nothing to be done there. It's a simple case of trade the reaction, understand what's happening, and then prepare yourself for the absolute next best trade to come. If that reaction doesn't come off that level, you simply wait for the next level, level to level trading environment. I just wanted to do this quick video to, so you understand the reason for this move to the downside. It was as simple as that. I saw the misinformation being spread and I just wanted to do this video to actually show you with the facts on the chart, the exact reason for that move to the downside. 
I'm actually going to get back to trading this right now. I need to keep up on, on top of this. All I will say is if you want to see my more in-depth analysis, then I have this morning done a live stream for the champions where I've gone over the trading setups for today. This was in a 35 minute long live stream dedicated to current price action and what I'm looking at next. So if you want to know my exact trading setups that I am looking at next, that's all covered inside the Discord and inside my latest champions live stream update. Okay, you can pause the screen and read this information here if you would like to fully understand that. But for me, the reason of this video was to quickly explain the reasons for this up, for, for this drop to the downside. And if you want to know what I'm looking at next, you can get that over on chartchampions.com now. I'm going to wrap it up there. Say th thank you ever so much. Hopefully you have enjoyed this quick video and now you absolutely do understand the reasons for this move to the downside. Thank you ever so much, everybody. And I will, if you're interested, see you over on the uh, website next live stream Sunday for the Champions in the Champions live stream. Cheers, everybody. Thank you and goodbye. Cheers.